Hello everyone! Today we have a pretty exciting adventure for you. We are taking our first ever visit to the Mitchell Park Domes. Located in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Besides the usual conservatory stuff that they have going on, there's also a winter flower and train show. Yeah, kind of think of the one at Old Brook in Madison. And today only, there's also a bonsai exhibit. <laughs> kind of interesting, but yeah, it's all included in the price of admission today, so we're going to check it out. I actually only recently found out about this through someone's post on Instagram. I have no idea how this place has past my radar for so long. All right, we have about two hours to see everything today before it closes down, so let's get inside. All right, we are inside. Here is our bonsai tree. And we do have a gift shop to check out. Hopefully, we can get our magnet. That's a big one. This is being run by the Milwaukee Bonsai Society. Yeah, so there's a lot to take in here. The show dome is where I believe the flower and train show is. So let's take a look at the tropical dome first, which I believe is more of a traditional conservatory. And this is really the main event that I'm here for today. It is the Planetary Orbit train show. There is a desert dome also. But let's go inside the tropical dome. Yeah, I thought there were three domes, so. Whew, nice and warm air. Wow. Yeah, someone just turned the heat up. Yeah, I can see why they call this the tropical dome. Definitely some Ulbrich vibes in here. The lipstick plant. Look at the size of those leaves. What I'm hearing from others is that these are banana trees. Well, we have found our first waterfall. Wonder if we'll see any more today. All right, got ourselves a pond here. With some fish. Oh, there's some spiky little things here. Oh, there's a fish over there, like, pushing the rock. <laughs> I think that's what that noise was.
See where this little pathway goes? <laughs> Not too far. Do you get a pretty decent view of this room? And that will about wrap it up from the tropical dome. This is a room that you can see any time of the year, as well as the desert dome, which we're gonna head to next. All yeah. right, here is the entrance to the desert dome. See if it's as warm as the tropical dome was. Funny enough, it seems a lot cooler than the Tropical Dome. I guess what they say is correct. It's just a dry heat. <laughs> I'm guessing we're gonna see less waterfall here and more cactus. And indeed, that is the case. And I would like to introduce you to Steve. Hello, Steve. Chilling on his rock, enjoying the warmth. Even though we are in desert, we have a little water. A big balloon or something up there. So it looks like we're supposed to watch out for doves. I have not seen any flying birds at all yet. Little round cactuses. I am not going to touch any of those. This is the Golden Barrel Cactus. Yeah, you don't find too many of those growing around McHenry. And we found a dove. Hanging out right in the middle of the pond. Ooh, a lot of spiky stuff over there. Lesson is, if you are in the desert, don't touch anything. <laughs> and that will wrap up the Desert Dome. Also a year-long thing. Alright, now it is time for the main attraction, the Show Dome. A dome dedicated to, I believe, four events each year, four themed events, I think coordinated around each season. And the winter theming this year is the train show. Maybe they host a train show every year. I really don't know. Like I said, I only recently found out about this place not too long ago. I've seen a variety of train shows recently. Can't forget about the circus-themed train show over in Oldbrook. Went to the big train expo over in Wisconsin State Fair. So let's see what this is about.
There you go. Planetary Orbits Train Show, January 14th through March 26th. Still got roughly another month left. Let's do this. And would you look at the size of that train display. All right. This is pretty nice. Now I'm definitely getting Oprah vibes. <laughs> One little car going there. That's cute. I don't know why, but I really like this little car. Better hurry up, little car. The big train is chasing you. Little observation area, cute little gazebo. And here is our planet, which some, interestingly, look like dog toys. Yeah, that was pretty nice. Like I said, I believe they have at least four themed events each year, so I'm definitely going to check it out more, and hopefully I'll be back. But for now, we're going to head to the gift shop and see if we can find a magnet. Well, surprisingly, that only took about an hour to go through, so we had plenty of time. But now we got a little extra time to kill, so 
uh, take a walk through the actual Mitchell Park. Should be a pond around here, and I think that's it. Surprising amount of snow up here. Actually, now that I think about it, the other day we had a pretty bad ice storm. And while we were getting all the ice, they were getting snow up in Wisconsin. So, yeah, that's what this is all about. Yeah, here's your pond. A little snow covered. No other major plans while I'm in Milwaukee. I might check out Potawatomi Casino. Last time I was there was at around Christmas time 2020 uh, when I was actually checking out the Christmas lights in downtown Milwaukee and a lot of stuff was still closed for COVID and all of that so haven't really gotten the full experience there yet and then other than that I'll be headed back to Illinois a little chilly but overall a really nice day today for the end of February I'm not going to complain Glad I made it out here, though. I have a feeling it won't be my last visit to the domes. Well, we definitely did a lot more things in February than I expected. Spring is almost here. And just about a month from now, We'll be back in Milwaukee for Midwest Gaming Classic. Can't wait. Make sure to subscribe. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Thank you for watching, and we will see you in the next video.